Hey folks, how are you guys doing? Hope you are all having a great day today. This is a introduction, problem, and solution type video based upon my little nesting chair I've got sitting right here. So, uh, introduction. So if you're not familiar, this is a little nesting chair. It's a chair that the seat comes out of completely. Two individual assemblies. The seat components completely come out and fit inside the back and then you can just grab the back and it latches onto both pieces for easy transport and easy storage. And because these fit into one another, that's where they get the name a nesting chair. It's commonly called a camp chair. Um, it's a nesting chair. <laughs> anyway, uh, my individual take on this or what is specific about it for me is I created a template to make the process extremely easy and repeatable uh, for anybody out there. So I wanted to make one of these personally and I found all the dimensions, all the plans are out there. You can, you can get all that information, but involves a lot of uh, measuring, marking, transferring, all that stuff. I wanted to make the process extremely simplified. And the solution is to come up with a template that has everything already laid out, ready to go, and then you just simply transfer that template to your workpiece. So that's what I did here. The template itself has a bunch of cleats into the template every for every location where there is a slat. So you simply attach the template to your workpiece, whatever material that you wanna make the chair out of, and you transfer that template shape to the material with a flush trim bit at the router table or a handheld router. That gives you a perfect, precise one-to-one -one copy, and it is extremely repeatable. You just pop the template off, put it on another one, and you're good to go again. So you can make as many as you want with those individual templates. Then, of course, assembly is just, it's very straightforward, extremely easy. You just screw the slats down, and you're good to go. So uh, that's, the, that's the introduction, that's the overview. This, that's what this chair is. Problem and then solution. The problem is that these are quite lengthy. There's, uh, these are, uh, they're just on the border of being a little bit too long for international shipping. That's where the real problem is. So when we launched this, and I say we because I put together a little bit of a team to help me with cutting out all these templates and getting them shipped, uh, it's completely our fault, but the way we ship them internationally, the, the templates, the packages, they're just, just a very slight, slight amount too long, which means our shipping goes from about nine to fifteen dollars ish, something like that, to ship international, all the way up to forty eight dollars. So everyone that we shipped out internationally got sent right back. That means uh, we are going to, for everything that was already ordered, we are going to eat the cost of international shipping to get them sent back out immediately and uh, that's on us, so very much appreciate your patience. Uh, if you ordered international, it's coming, slight delay. Going forward, that's just not an economical way to ship stuff internationally for all parties involved. So the solution is, which this is something that's going to help uh, all orders, the solution is to break the templates up right in the middle. So instead of having one long template, actually two long templates, one for the back, one for the seat, you're gonna get four pieces that once assembled create two templates. The pieces are going to be cut in half and have a locking dovetail, so that way once you get them, you can click them together and then you have the full length template. This allows us to ship, instead of uh, two pieces stacked very long, we'll have four pieces stacked, which adds rigidity for the shipping purposes, but also decreases the length quite a bit. Um, so, like I said, when you get them, you can click them together and put tape on them to leave them clicked together for their life of the, of the template, whatever you wanna do, or just click them together, stick them down, use the template, uh, disconnect them, and you know store them a little bit uh, easier, flat pack, shorter, all that stuff. So, overview, problem, solution. Uh, like I said, if you ordered international, thank you very much for your patience. They are all on the way to you once again. Uh, just an update, that's the way that these are going to be cut going forward in multiple pieces, same precision, same overall outcome for all of you out there. If you ordered one, thank you very much. Uh, if you haven't seen this one yet, I'll have a link to the video down below where you can see one of these being made. 
Like I said, it's very easy and it's very easy to reproduce. You guys take care, have a great day, and I'll talk to you in the next video.